Welcome back now at five. One of the best ways to get ahead financially is to make your money work for you. But what's the best strategy to do that? As Fox 59 Zach Myers reports, it depends on how much money you have to work with yeah. and what your goals are. Say you've already got your retirement savings going and you don't want to touch that. Now you're looking for ways to save and grow more money in the shorter term. The good thing is there is a lot of options to do with just your that pile of savings you have. You've probably just put it in there and you've forgotten about it, but there's a lot of options you can do. If you've been able to save up between one and ten thousand dollars, Forum Credit Union COO Andy Mattingly says you could consider a high-rate savings account, which many banks and institutions are offering these days. These high-rate savings accounts are typically for people who plan to keep the money a little bit longer, and that's why institutions offer those, because it's not going to be coming in and out all the time. Right now, you can expect to get somewhere between 3.9 and 4.3% APY. He says most people can get one of these accounts and there's no real downside to them, although some include restrictions and fees that you might want to avoid. Maybe there's a limit on how much you can put in each month, or maybe there's a limit on how much you can take out, or maybe there's certain things you have to do to get it. With about the same amount of money, Mattingly recommends CDs, or certificates of deposit. People forget about these or think these are only for their grandparents, but certificates are actually a good tool. Basically, they're just saying you're going to leave the money on deposit for a certain period of time, and that's where you can probably get your highest rates. Terms can range between a few months to five or six years. Right now, he says you can expect about 5% interest on your money with a term of 5 to 20 months. People often have several overlapping CDs going at once, so you always have money growing and ready to withdraw when the terms are up. If you have more money to invest, say $25,000 or more, it might be time to look at a money market. Mattingly says that usually needs to be with the same institution that has your checking account. A lot of those times that's where you're going to need to talk to your financial institution because those are things that they're going to be offering to you based on the relationships that you have. Overall, Mattingly says the best option is several options. Not to just pick one, but try to take multiple strategies depending upon how much money you have because that's the best way to protect yourself. Zach Myers, Fox 59 News. We have plenty of consumer reports to help protect your money on our website. You can also find more ways to save before the holiday shopping season. Just head to our website, fox59.com.